that's the stuff that's the stuff right there all right what's going on guys how do you do it's your boy gray here and welcome back to the channel ladies and gentlemen i do this at the start of every year we revisit older call of duty titles i usually like to start with call of duty ghosts and uh we're here now here's some lore here's a here's a big fact about myself you guys probably if you've been around long enough you probably know what i'm about to say but i actually played call of duty ghost uh for two years till this day i have never played one second of advanced warfare at the time when advanced warfare came out i just wasn't ready for like the advanced movement and the jetpacks and stuff like that so i actually just stuck with call of duty ghost for two years the TTK. I thought it was fast in other Call of Duty titles, man, but this one, this thing is instant right here. Up we move. This is one of those guns that I 100% I missed this gun, man. I wish they would bring it back one day. One of these things, so whenever you would see this, you see right here it says press to hold, and you could actually um, you could do something to like affect the environment. So now you have See right there now you have a a post where you can look across over here like this playing guy here on my right i believe see him go make the move there you go take another year might be two there he is watch out dog that one too. there you go Oh, this is pretty crazy, man. The number of players, it actually shows you. This was one of the last Call of Duties that actually told you how many players were online. Um, the online players is 259. I think this is the lowest I've seen it. I played a little bit last night and that number was actually close to really close to 500. So it's surprising to see this low right now. I mean, as I'm recording this intro, it is currently Thursday, January 4th at uh, it's about 1.30 p.m. I want to test something out real quick. I want to see how long it, it'll take me to find a, a game uh, right now. I'm not going to do any edits. I just want to see in real time how long this will take to find a lobby. Uh, I really enjoyed this Call of Duty a lot back in the day. This is definitely in my top five. I know that's weird to say because a lot of people hate this Call of Duty. I don't know why. I really don't know why they hated this Call of Duty. I know there were several. Wow, look at that. <laughs> it, 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 this was this was probably faster than our current Call of Duty title that we have right now. I'm not going to lie. That's kind of sad. 259 players right now playing this game, and I found a lobby faster than what our current Call of Duty uh, will will allow us to find a lobby. Can't come back to this game and, and not play this map. Or specifically, can't come back to this game and not snipe on this map, I should say. Oh, damn, I didn't even see him. Oh, he had that shot. He had a clean shot of me there, too. Wow. This was Ground War and Warzone. I should say Warzone. This was Warzone before Warzone. Damn, that's a long shot. Take that. We're in the lead. Feels really off right now. I don't even have a secondary here. I gotta live with what I, whatever I do. Any shots I miss, I miss. One more. No, oh, one more, one more. Satcom Everybody's favorite satcom. Oh, keep walking. Ah, come on. Oh, jeez. Oh, God, God. Rufus. No. <laughs> Sorry. Game is really pissing me off, man. These hit markers. You got to you got to use this optic too. If you're playing this map, has to be the thermal. I don't know. I don't know why people hated this game so much. Um, it had a lot of great innovations. Um, the weapons were great. The prestige system was great. 
multiplayer maps were great aside from one or two maps but that's every call of duty every call of duty map has every call of duty has maps that people really dis dislike going through the weapon select and the assault rifles here this was this these were really some top-notch choices that we had man this this till this day is one of my favorite guns that i've ever used in a call of duty game man the fad was such a slapper the honey badger i mean listen i don't even gotta say nothing about the honey badger probably one of the best weapons in the game we've only ever seen it twice i think i have some gameplay with this one in today's video uh the ripper the hybrid gun um and then my personal all-time favorite weapon the mtar i love this gun in any call of duty whatever call of duty it's in whether it's an smg or an assault rifle whatever it is i usually gravitate a lot towards the uh the ram it's called the ram now but the mtar the lsat was such a oh my god i used to use the lsat all the time really good gun uh the chainsaw really fun to use the marksman rifle is really great the mk14 ebr till this day one of my favorite uh marksman rifles to use a really great weapon looking at the maverick a12 there were three weapons i believe it was the maverick it was the assault rifle whatever that one was called and the i think the ripper those are the, the three guns that they were like released after the game was was like done the life cycle was done they released it as dlc weapons that you could purchase um looking at the sniper i'm mean, come on that's a, that's a classic right there the vks i actually built out the vks in uh modern warfare 2019 i actually showed you guys how you could build out the uh, vks sniper uh in that game currently rocking the ripper which is one of my all-time favorite weapons and i always i always wish they would bring back the ripper because you could uh it's a hybrid it's a hybrid you could go smg or you could go assault rifle and we've only ever seen it in this game and in infinite warfare i believe so in smg mode it has a really fast fire rate and in assault rifle mode it's it's slow fire rate but it's very accurate oh two all right Ah, uh, duh. How many people here? That com up link enabled. We're in the lead. SMG mode is the way to go, though. Hundred <laughs> percent. Does this still work? It still works. That's funny. I don't think the entrance is over here. I think it's this door here. Oh, see me? Did you see me? Oh, teammate. Let me let me get that. window that was a that was a campy ass window you used to be able to climb this structure and actually climb up into those windows will you relax with the hiding in corners I'm trying to show something here yep he's still there oh my god i'm gonna go for it he's got all the advantage all he has to do is pre-aim oh he moved We're in the lead. there you go let's lean on it Come back, come back. I'm in pursuit. One more. Care package ready for direction. Oh my goodness. Ah. Oh. Oracle ready. Why? Friendly Oracle overhead. That's me. I should have switched. I should have. I should have switched to uh, SMG, but I didn't have time. Back. Back. Three players over here. What is it with people in this uh, launcher now in this game? I played this game last year and the year before and the year before that and that launcher was not as eminent as it is now. Yeah, whatever, let's let's use it just for the video. Typically, I would just want to continue. So you got a care package. Well, hang on, you got to call it in somewhere where people can get it. There's fine, yeah. Care package. All right, you can call in a juggernaut too. We're winning this fight. Get him. Target killed. Bye, Rufus. If this guy is still here, that is crazy. Right there. Hey. It's been years. It's been years, my man. I don't know why you're still just hiding in the camping in spots. Come on.
if you guys played this game and you remember this game, what were your thoughts on the create a class system? I thought that this was a really good class system because it made you choose what you wanted to do and how you wanted to play, but it still let you utilize a lot of different things. Um, I thought this was a fun class class setup system. Oh, by the way, check this out. Look, all right. So if you go to customize appearance and you want to select an operator, the Elias, the Elias uh, character, this is the one I was telling you guys. There was a bundle that released a couple of days ago. I actually covered it. It's on the channel. It's, I think it was called the Null and Void bundle. This was the operator. I was telling you guys that that's, that's what the operator looked like. It looks just like this guy. It's always fun coming back to these Call of Duty games and just seeing how the population is, seeing how, you know, how lobbies are playing. I got to say, though, this, this is the first time that I've come into this game and I could tell that there was just something off about it. I think I think people are more so like I don't I don't know if they're hacking and stuff into it or if they're using cheats, but something just feels really off about this game. But it's the first time that I felt that ever, like ever coming back to Call of Duty Ghost. I'm not really sure what the hell is going on with those launchers. Like people like oh, everybody was using launchers when I was uh, getting gameplay footage. I don't know why the, those launchers all of a sudden the thing to use. But it's great coming back to this Call of Duty and I had a lot of fun and I'm looking forward to hopefully coming back next year and seeing how, it, how it's holding up, man. I, I really hope that one day we get a sequel. I know a lot of people didn't like this game. I don't know why. I, th I thought it was a great game, but we c I think we can all agree that story mode was fantastic. And that cliffhanger, oh, that, that, that cliffhanger broke our hearts, man. We got to know what happens next. So Infinity Ward, if you guys are listening, which I doubt you are, but if you are, man, we really need a part two to Call of Duty Ghost, man. And man, I'm going to call it there for me today, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay and just coming back here to Call of Duty Ghost in 2024. Let me know if you guys still play this game. Let me know if, what your thoughts were when this game was available, like when more people were playing. Let me know what your thoughts were on this one. You guys know I love this game. I really, really did. And um, yeah, thank you so much for watching today's video. We got more of these going back to older Call of Duty titles videos uh, coming up soon. So stick around, ladies and gentlemen, if you are brand new around here. Here. if you haven't done so already don't forget to subscribe to the channel turn on notifications and drop a like on today's video it would really help out i'm definitely looking forward to reading all your comments i'm looking forward to getting back to as many people as i can um, if you guys are thinking about getting any control freak products you can always check out their website link in the description below you can use code gray at checkout to get a great discount off your i believe it's a 10 to 15 percent discount off your order go check them out they actually just got some new mw3 products over there if you guys are thinking about getting any g fuel products i'm actually currently currently having some hype sauce if you guys are thinking about getting some g fuel go check them out link in the description below you can use code yt gray over on their website over at checkout to get a great discount they have a bunch of different flavors hydration packs tubs shaker cups cans a lot of stuff over there and, and of course lastly if you guys are thinking about getting a new controller for playstation xbox or pc highly recommend checking out aim controllers link in the description below you can use code gray uh, or just click on the link and the discount should apply automatically if you guys ever want to stop by our live stream we been streaming over on kick lately if you guys want to stop on in come hang out with us link in the description below please give us a follow over on kick give us a follow also outside of youtube on our social media platforms. stay connected tiktok twitter instagram snapchat links to everything in the description below and uh, i'm gonna call it there for me today you guys all right thank you so much for watching till the next one my name is gray peace